Hi everyone, nice to see you all. So the EAA and the EANZ, um, like they were saying before, is a not-for-profit organisation. We offer support and education around eczema. I've got I'm the carer to my husband, Reese, who you'll meet soon. So yeah, the EANZ offers support through the phone and email, like Cheryl said. We are one of the only ones in New Zealand that offer eczema support. So please feel free to reach out to us anytime that you need a hand. We've got some great information sheets that we can send out to you and um, all of that sort of thing. So the treatments are, um, that are available in New Zealand, we're a little bit behind the ball with a lot of things. Um, for the mild to moderate um, eczema treatments, as well as the severe sufferers as well, our topical steroids are generally uh, what's used. Immunosuppressants such as cyclosporin and methotrexate um, can often be a default. Antibiotics are generally used to stop infections. Bleach baths, wet wrapping, that sort of thing is quite common in how we treat uh, the eczema in New Zealand. We don't have the bio ones that Australia and a lot of the other countries around the world have. We're working really hard at the moment to get them in New Zealand, approved and funded. Um, so that's been our um, job in the last um, little while is to get those pushed through. Um, we do have access to things like light therapy, the immunosuppressant medication um, and steroids and things. but. Like they said before, it's more about management um, than actual treatment at the moment, and we're working really hard to, to get that sorted. Next slide, please, Betsy. So carer tips. I've been a carer for Reese um, for quite some time now, and the biggest tip that I would have for people is um, be kind to yourself. Eczema is, has a, a ripple effect, and it doesn't just affect the sufferer. It also affects family members and those close to the eczema patient. So it's really about being kind to yourself, making sure that you are looking after your own mental health. Um, you know, if we fall apart, everybody else falls apart too. So it's really important that you take time to um, really build up your own stability, make sure that your balance is there so that you're able to give the person that you're caring with for and your family the best of yourself. Um, depression is a really major thing that impacts eczema sufferers, um, but can also affect the carer as well. So being aware that your mental health is something that is going to um, fluctuate is really important um, to be aware of and to seek help if you're in that position. So let us support you. Um, if you'd like to reach out to us, we're available through phone and email. Head to our website, there's a huge amount of resources on there, lots of tips and tricks and um, all that sort of thing as well. You can find all our details on our website and on the screen. So thank you everybody. Um, yeah, please feel free to reach out anytime. It'd be great to hear from you.